What's up, YouTube? Simply on Lucky here. Today we're opening Konami's newest set is Battles of Legend Terminal Revenge. But first, I want to ask you guys to check out the channel, subscribe for more insane, if not godly videos, and of course, give this video a thumbs up. And speaking of those thumbs, guys, we're giving away an entire booster box Battles of Legend Terminal Revenge. All that you guys have to do is make sure you're subscribed, give us that thumbs, and of course, post in the comments below. What do you guys think about Konami's new Dragon Master Magia? Is that what they want to call that guy? Let us know in the comments below. This card looks insane. It's the card on the box. As you can see, it only comes use QCR, meaning so one in eight to 10 cases. That's insane to think about because I think it's three QCRs per case. So very hard card to pull. Very cool looking card. Hopefully I get one for you today. That would be insane. But yeah, let me know in the comments below what you guys think about it. Let me, let me know what you think about the effect as well. It's uh, Some people say, might try to play. All right, guys, we're gonna jump right in term, Terminal Revenge. This again is Konami's newest set. I think that overall, this is a fun set. They brought back the Hidden Arsenal cards, you know? They, I think, did a lot that everyone was hoping they could do. We'll just kind of see how it works out here. So there is a very strong U-Bell card in here that you're gonna see a lot of value. Um, but it's only gonna be a couple per case. So we're not gonna see too much, but here for our first box, we'll kind of test the waters see where it takes us. So our first secret, right in the middle of the pack here is Archfiend's Advent. This, um, you guys didn't see a video from me, but this is the Shining Sarcophagus cards from the Legacy, newest Legacy set from Konami. Um, I think it's cool that Konami's giving this like Millennium, or not Millennium, sorry, that's the next set, or classic like Yugi deck support focusing on Shining Sarcophagus. So that's the concept there. Let's see if I can get a QCR box for you guys. We got the R Gen X cards, the Voids, we got Ritual Beast making a comeback in here, and actually it's pretty strong. People are pretty excited for it. Um, getting an access to a whole line of Infernoids is, just seems crazy. I hated playing against that deck. But yeah, the Ritual Beast cards, I think the, one of the most valuable cards in the set is actually what the new, I want to say Tamer, uh, but Ritual Beast girl. Gathering Lights, we got Electrodes in here, the Ebon Sun, another secret. And some crazy, oh, Scrap Goblin, nice. Some crazy short prints in here too. Out of an entire case, you might see two of a secret. U-Bell's one of them, two or three. Full-powered Utopia Ray Lancer, nice. Oh, that was the wonky quartet in that pack. Look at this card. What in the world? But I always like a set with a massive nostalgic card on the front. The toy, a lot of toy support in here. Ace of Spades, I believe this will be an archetype in some future sets coming soon. Um, whole sprite deck in here. Entire sprite lineup. Maybe I should say sprite engine. Got Birdman. Ice Jades. I think Birdman has an alternative art as well. Interesting how they did that. Ooh! QCR first box! Yo, Konami still giving us love even when we don't make videos for a minute. Is this guy is this guy a fusion? Holy crap. So check this out. We're gonna look at this QCR real quick. And if it's purple, if it's purple, it's either U-Bell or Dragon Master. And a couple other cards, but we're just gonna pretend it's one of those two. You guys ready? Seems a little brown. Seems a little brown. Well, also in this set is the new Sky Strikers alternative arts for Rose and um, our girl Ray. So there's another option. Sky Striker Rose! <laughs> Let's go! What a first box! What a first box! Holy freaking guacamole, man! Wow! Man, we need to make more Yu-Gi-Oh! videos more often. This is probably top three, four cards I wanted from the set, so that's really cool. I love when Konami takes a classic archetype. I guess this is not so classic, but an epic archetype, remakes it, gives us some nice fun art, and gives it high rarities. A lot of bonuses here, guys. This is Sky Striker Ace Rose Alternative Art. What a pull as a QCR. Oh, baby. All right. Oh, nice little Ultra Cartesia. There is a QCR there. And I want to just traverse these boxes. Let me see if I could get a nice medallion as an Ultra. Oh, Sprites. A life hack. It's an interesting one. Legendary Exodia Incarnate. Is this in here's QCR? Holy guacamole. Very, very good set. Um, life hack. And this is a very fun card. Lancia, Ancestral Dragon of the Mountain. I believe it's some Ice Barrier, Lancia, Wombo combo there. I believe it's also hard to pull. 
So QCR Ray, already a stupid value box. Synchro Greed, nice Ritual Beast. Synchro Greed, this card's fun. If a Synchro Monster's on the field, draw one. Then if you have three or more Synchros, draw two. Uh, Sangan Jin, why is he in here? I believe on the bottom they added this card is treated as Millennium, which is gonna be our next set, which I'm super stoked to open for you guys. This Gen X controller, guys, quite nice. Ib is an Ultra. Got one of the Lubellions here. It's interesting for your Gen X cards. All right, guys, left side. Ice Jades, I did not realize there was a ton of Ice Jades. Ooh, Spiritual Beast Tamer, Winda. All right, guys, let's continue on this left side. This is Konami's newest set. This is Arsenal Terminal Revenge. <laughs> Got Infernoids for days. So, I guess they kind of, I guess the Ally of Justice has always kind of been mixed with the Gen X. Dude, Ice Jades, man. Orcus, got one Orcus card in here. Got the heart back. I believe Orcus support coming, right? And toy box, Ritual Beast, nice. Ulti, Gaia Pelio. I think I said that right. And we got the other Ritual Beast in there, Ulti. Let's see if we can get any other awesome, maybe some short prints here. Gorgeous Swordsman of the Ice Barrier. Uh, actually, uh, one of the more valuable secrets, even though once we get into this value range, it's not much, but still getting pack value, I think. You are definitely QCR hunting with this set. Should be three per case, one in four boxes, but you're gonna see high value QCRs in here as we did pull one of the top ones in the set here. Last three packs, guys. This is our first box here. Try to do one more for you. Ancient Gear Dragon, they did get us a new Ancient Gear card. I do like that. Looks cool too, if you actually look at that picture. Ritual Beast, Ulti, wow, Rara Tari. Doubt they want me to say it like that, but that's still freaking cool. This is the new boss monster. And last pack of Destiny, guys. Maybe a little U-Bell magic right at the end here. Give us a little, give us a little purple. Proxy F Magician, guys. Very nice. This is the last pull in this box, and we'll go on to our next one. I'm going to try to go for one more QCR before we end this video. I know we did really good, and I shouldn't complain. We pulled the rose. Let's just go a little bit further here and see what we can get. Toy box, Tri Brigade card in here. Nice Ritual Beast. Yes, I seem more interested in the Ritual Beast cards than anything else we're pulling. That's fine. I uh, did get one of the QCRs we wanted for sure. Aeromage or Aroma Seraphy. This is Jasmine. Man, that, that deck was crazy for a while. This is an alternative art medallion of the Ice Barrier. That's very cool. Ebon's son is back. I think that's a new Sky Striker card. Oh, there's your alt art, Genix Ally Birdman. Two alts, just like that. And I was like, I don't even know if I know of any others. Let's see, there's that wonky card. Legendary Exodian card, and I'm actually pretty excited to be pulling those. Legendary Exodia. Exodia. Alliterate, Substitute, that's a big card in this set. We'll set that one over there. So we are looking for another QCR, but we are also looking for a U-Bell. Man, if you get a U-Bell QCR box, whoo! Again, that U-Bell might be one per, or two per case. So, basically more rare than getting a QCR. The QCRs are three. Void Imagination. You guys want to post in the comments, I'd appreciate some. Is there a Yu-Gi-Oh! lore story for the Voids, Infernoids? Curious. I mean, if you have time, maybe the Ritual Beast one as well, because I'll read it. Seriously. <laughs> Do it for me, please. Um, but yeah, it would be fun to, to, to see what's going on there. Mira, Ritual Beast Ulti Gaia. There's our Winda girl went pretty crazy in the beginning here i feel like rose is definitely gonna be one of the more valuable cards in the entire set primus pyramus all right old t conahawk windows for days come on the end of anubis is actually in here um kind of a walking necro valley i believe pretty cool Getting into our Shining Star Dragon. Nice. Um, this is a new card in the set. It's actually kind of cool. You'll see that kind of one of the more valuable cards. 
I don't believe it's as short printed as like Substitute or Yubel. It's still nice to see a new card that promotes tuning and 5Ds. Snatch Steel, Secret Rare. Speaking of nostalgic cards, doesn't get more nostalgic than that. High Rarity Snatch Steel, no longer considered crazy broken in the current format of Yu-Gi-Oh! Mirror Mage. Who would have thought? One Diviner so far. Wow. Ooh, that looks sweet. That is a new evolution of Brionic. Last but not least from this booster box, Proxy Magician in the last pack, Skelga. All right, you guys, another booster box coming your way here. We got that QCR Rose, but again, shout out to that giveaway. We're giving away an entire booster box sealed of Battles of Legend, Terminal Revenge. Just give it that thumbs. Again, post in the comments below. Let us know what you guys think about um, the new boss monster here. It's the Dragon Master Magia. Also, some lore stories, if you guys have them, we'd love to hear some lore, see some lore comments in their discussion. Let us know. And of course, uh, shout out to the link at the top of the description below, guys. We are doing some more streaming on whatnot. We have a couple part-time streamers hanging out and they're doing singles from the Simply Unlucky Game Shop. Um, everything I think is getting auctioned for the most part, some fun games that they do in there. A lot of giveaways. And so uh, go check that out, link at the top of the description below. Okay guys, here we go. Another 12 booster packs. now. We are going to hit a QCR here, and we're just going to have fun with it. We're going to get a little U-Bell magic going on. And uh, there's a nice Mirror Jade there, ultra rare. Ace of Spades, and a lot of fusions we're getting right now, guys, but we're not getting big old U-Bell. Atlantia, nice, the Ancestral Dragon of the Ice Mountain. Few more packs here on the right side, guys. Don't give up hope. <sighs> double the QCR, double the fun, guys. I told you we're gonna keep going here. We gotta try to pull another QCR from this box. Show us purple. Bro. Whoa! Whoa! All right, all right, hold on. Like, for real, guys, how many purples? Like, let's be real. Let's be real here. Five? Six? Dude, I have, like, no clue. Let's go with... Let's make our chances sound more fun here. Let's go four. I think there's at least four. Sounds like a good number. We have a one in four chance! We got a one in four chance at pulling. Kaiba's Dragon Master Knights! Oh! QCR U Bell! Holy guac of freaking moly! Who needs the secret when you get the QCR? Oh my lord, have mercy on our souls! Bro. Wow. I was gonna say U Bell's second best thing, because that's why we wanted to see the purple. We had the U-Bell. We have the Dragon Master Knight. You know what's going to be crazy? Can we get the secret U-Bell with the QCR? Can we do the impossible? I bet you don't see that too often. All right. All right. Clearing the stage here, guys. U-Bell QCR and a Rose QCR? Sheesh. Guys. Guys. Let's do this right here, right now. Secret U Bell to go with our beautiful QCR. Um, we'll check out the effect here with the uh, the secret that we pull. Okay. <laughs> I can't believe we pulled that. I was gonna say we said we said it earlier. U Bell and golly, U Bell's up up there. So is Sky Striker Ray. But U Bell's up there and Dragon Master. Got it. We tasted it. We tasted that sweet, sweet Dragon Master, didn't we? So close. You could feel his presence. If we would have pulled that guy, that would have been stupid. To get the U Bell is pretty crazy. We got the gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous swordsman. 
All right. So that QCR U-Bell, very hard to pull. You know, one out of whatever the ratio is. So three, so eight cases. There's 25 QCRs to get the specific one. That's why I was saying Dragon Master Knight only comes QCR. Now, can we pull a secret U-Bell from the same box as the QCR? Let's just go nuts. Let's go the distance here. Same gang jam. Because yes. Oh man. Let's get an Exodia. I feel like if we obliterate, maybe we'll we'll get the U-Bell. Woo! We tasted it. Another fusion. It's the Dusk Dragon. Give it to us. Kaiba! Bro. You bet. <laughs> hey, it was, it was just speculation, all right? It was just speculation. <laughs> oh, man. It's fun, man, making videos. We got to do this more often, guys. All right. That is it, guys. I think I'm good with Terminal Revenge. I feel like we got two QCRs. We made the way... We got, we went the distance and we went crazy here. We got one of the top expensive, valuable cards here. Top playable card here. This is it guys. This is Phantom of Ubel, and um, it's going to take over here quite soon. And we didn't get a secret. I know, right? What are you doing simply? No, we went, we went beyond an expectation and got it QCR for you. So, and of course the Rose little beauty over there all right you guys as always thank you so much for watching this is battles of legend terminal revenge this is konami's newest set and remember to enter that giveaway to get today guys but just being subscribed commenting below you know letting us know what you guys think about these new cards here um even you know give us some lore guys on terminal revenge or slash um hidden arsenal you know a lot of cool cards in here the cool stories that konami's made up over the years you know let us know in the comments below and as always simply Unlucky. Signing out.